Good morning, you guys, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it is day 8 already of Vlogmas. I just said that out loud. I should have, I don't know why this is a shock. I had literally just finished editing Vlogmas Day 7, but it was for some reason still shocked to me that today is day 8, but I just feel like this month has literally flown by. It is the 18th of December today. Christmas is literally a week from today. I am so freaking excited about it. So we, it is a Sunday. It is now 9, 12 in the morning, kind of just a casual morning for us. You guys know Sundays are a little bit more laid back. We literally have nothing going on today. We are just going up to my sister's house for brunch. Y'all know that we're big brunch people now. I told you that. We are big brunch people at the moment. And so we're going up to their house today to do brunch. I have to take some pictures in the outfit that I'm wearing right now. So it is from CRZ Yoga. So I have on this cute little like cropped tight quarter zip. And then I have on some, I think it's my fleece leggings. They are super, super thick. It is very comfortable, but I love the color combination of this fit. I also feel like, okay, like you guys are going to tell me it's not. So just like take it with a grain of salt. But I feel like the bump is popping today. Like I feel like she's a moment right now. I'm going to toss a little vest over top of it. I have on some high white socks, which has kind of been my vibe recently. Some sneakers, and we're going to take some pictures on my way up to my sister's house. So it's a pretty casual day. We have to run to get food shopping done. We have to get some last minute like gifts because Christmas is a week away. We only have one more gift each to buy. So we're gonna go to Target and get that taken care of. And then we're gonna get laundry. We're gonna do some wrapping. So kind of just like a productive, but also a casual Sunday, which is my favorite. The sun is finally back out. You guys know I told you in my last vlog, it literally was raining for 48 hours straight. That's not an exaggeration. It was cloudy and miserable for 48 hours straight, but the sun is back out today. So it's a perfect day to go outside and take some pictures in this fit that I need to post for CRZ Yoga because I didn't do it the past couple days, which I needed to because it was miserable outside. I'm certainly not going out in the rain. So now that it's nice out, I'm gonna take some pictures in the fit today. I had my iced chai latte already. You guys know I made, I mixed it. I'm so, you're so far away. I mean, let me talk to you closer. I mix it with the caramel macchiato mix from like the International Delight brand. That's what Timmy uses with his coffee some of the time. And I've never used it with that because normally I just use almond milk, but we ran out of almond milk. So I tried it with the caramel macchiato and it was so delicious. It definitely like tasted less like chai and more like the creamer. So if I continue to use it, I'm not gonna need to put nearly as much creamer as I did almond milk, but it was still really, really good. It was nice and it was definitely different, but y'all know when I have my iced chai latte, I feel a little bit like a, on a caffeine high for a moment since I don't drink it that much anymore, but I've been loving it. So it was a nice little combo to start the morning off. All right, y'all, it is now one o'clock and we are leaving my sister's house now. We did brunch there. It was so freaking good. We did like eggs, bagels, bacon. They had fruit, hash browns, the whole nine. It was absolutely delicious. And then it was the World Cup final today. So Argentina versus France. And it was literally the craziest game that I have seen in so long. It ended up being 3-3 at the end of the game after overtime and everything. And and then went into penalty kicks and then Argentina ended up winning. It was just a wild game. And like, listen, if you don't like soccer, I know you won't really care about that, but it was absolutely so freaking cool to watch. It is such a awful way to end a really good World Cup final game is by losing in penalty kicks, but it was just a really, really fun and exciting game to watch. So we're a little bit later in the rest of our day than we were kind of planning because the game was so good, but now we are on our way to Giant now to go food shopping and then we'll bring all the stuff home and run out to Target and finish up our Christmas shopping and then get home do laundry and wrap and all of that so a little bit later in our day but it was like just such a crazy game I literally still can knock it over how good the game was but on to the rest of our day now
are back from Target now, and I figured I would show y'all what we got. We were so good. We only had to shop for one thing when I was at Target. Timmy's cousins do this white elephant Pollyanna where everyone like brings a gift, you put it into the center, and then you all take numbers and you open, we can either open a gift in the center or steal a gift from somebody based off of your numbers. So literally like anyone in the group of 12 to 15 people could get your gift. So you always try to get like something that like basically everybody could use. And so this year, normally I do like house decor, stuff like that, but this year I decided to go with this big, comfy, micro plush blanket. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I own this, and it is mine and the cat's favorite blanket in the entire world. We're literally obsessed with it. This is like the only blanket I use all day, every day now. So I got that. And then to go with that kind of like same comfy, cozy vibe, I went with... Bum, 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 bum. I went with the candle. I got a, it's a peony and cherry blossom candle. It smells delicious. I am so picky with candles and I love the smell of this candle. So that's what I bought for that. I would be so excited to receive this gift. If I opened up this gift and that's what was inside, I would be thrilled. So I hope that somebody else is thrilled as well. And then in the mail for work this year, my company gave all of the managers free shoes from Sakani, Sakoni, Sakani. I don't really know how to pronounce it, to be honest with you. But they all gave us a free choice of like five different types of shoes. And so I got the Freedom Fives. So this is what they look like. I think they're really cute. They're just like a plain black shoe. This was their most like diverse shoe that you could like run in, train in, lift in, the whole nine. There were some that were like specific running shoes because I think it's like mostly a running brand. So like specific running shoes, some that were like specifically for more like casual wear. This was kind of like an everything shoe, which is why I liked it. And I figured I went black just because it would match everything that I wear. I could wear it at work. So I'm super excited about it. I think I'm going to wear it to work tomorrow. I can't wait. I got my normal size, a size seven. So I'll keep you guys posted. But I'm super hype about it. They they gave us an option between like six different type of shoes. And some were like $60. And those were like $150. So I was like, I'm going to get the $150 ones. Because if they're going to be paying for it, no matter what, I'm going to get the most expensive ones, the most diverse ones. And I'm pretty happy about it. So that's kind of our little haul of what we got. But like, I'm obsessed with this gift. I almost wish that I could keep it for myself. I'm not going to, because I already have this blanket. I don't need another one. But I almost wish I could. Listen, I know that you're shocked, but I'm eating this again today. Pretzel crisps and, oh God, I just dropped my chicken salad. Pretzel crisps and chicken salad. I have the buffalo crisps again, which are superior to the regular ones because it just tastes like you're eating buffalo chicken dip then. I really love it. I don't know if I could even consider it a pregnancy craving. It's not something that I'm craving 24 seven. Like I don't like meat. Oh, I don't like need buffalo chicken dip, but at the same time, it always sounds appetizing. Like I could eat it as any snack throughout the course of the day. You know what I mean? Like I don't need to have it. Like when I want sour candy, I like need sour candy in my life right now. This isn't like that. I just like really want it all the time. Like I could eat it at any snack or for lunch or dinner. You know what I mean? Guys, there is literally nothing in this world that I despise more than wrapping Christmas gifts. Maybe that's pretty Scrooge of me. I don't really know, but I just don't enjoy it. It's not my thing. I get very stressed out by it. I literally almost had a breakdown a few moments ago because of Christmas gifts. Because I just am not literally good at wrapping them. I'm just not. I wish that I was, but I'm not. So I think I'm gonna use this. We don't have a ton of gift wrapping. I think I'm gonna use the leftover pieces that I have from some other gifts as wrapping paper. As like a little, not, you know what I mean, like gift wrap. So it's for my family, Pollyanna. It's for my sister-in-law now. I got her like a cute little like self care kit. So I got her a bunch of different face masks. I got her some bath bombs, some nail polish, a gift card to Ulta. I feel like it's just a like, bunch of little things, but things that I feel like she'll really appreciate. You know what I mean? Things that every mom needs in their life. There we go. Now let's close it up. Let's put them here, here. Beautiful. This is the part that I'm really bad at. It's the wrapping, actual wrapping aspect.
the box upside down again. Well, whatever. What? I just ripped the wrap. No, actually, <laughs> actually might have helped me. Alright y'all, I am just putting on a face mask. I just got done in the shower. It was a hair wash, a leg shave day. Y'all already know how it goes. Sunday is the best day for all of that. Get ourselves set and prepared for the week. Now I'm putting on a face mask. This is what I am using. It's literally just like this basic cucumber cooling peel off face off facial mask it's like very refreshing which is kind of what i need right now i feel like my skin has been so incredibly dry the past like week or so so it just needs a little bit of something you know honestly guys today i feel like this vlog has just oh i might just drip some of that on the floor i feel like this vlog has literally been filled with just like a bunch of things that I dislike doing like food shopping and laundry and gift wrapping and it's not that I don't like giving gifts I love giving gifts I just hate wrapping gifts I wish someone could do the wrapping for me you know what I mean I'm just not good at it for some reason my brain just like doesn't connect how to do it which I know is so stupid but it literally doesn't my brain like does not connect how to like wrap the gift and make it I don't know and just like not make a mess and make it look frumpy and gross like for some reason that's just like I don't know if I was just never taught I don't know I don't know what the problem is it's fully me I'm definitely the problem but I just really don't know why I dislike it so much but I just dislike it I always have but typically I have like Timmy wrap for me or my mom wrap for me when I used to live there but now that I am a big girl I need to start wrapping for myself and especially if it is a gift for Timmy I can't make Timmy wrap my gifts. You know what I mean? Like, it's pretty unacceptable to make him wrap his own gifts. I would do it, but I just feels wrong. You know what I mean? He'll definitely wrap majority of the gifts for our kids later in life, but because I just dislike it and I don't think I'll ever start liking it, but maybe like with practice, I'll get better at it. I'm trying to stay positive, trying to stay optimistic about it. I just doubt it. So we are kind of unwinding for the rest of the night. We did ravioli and Caesar salad for dinner. Nice and casual. We don't like doing anything like super fancy for dinner on Sundays because we don't really just want to like prep and clean up a ton. So ravioli was like perfect, easy. We did raviolis, little pieces of bread, and then a Caesar salad, which is absolutely perfect. And then we folded our clothes, took a shower, did my like skincare routine. So I lotioned everything up and now I put on a face mask and we're literally gonna chill on the couch. I have to like wait and let this harden. You literally can't even see that it's on because it is literally just a clear face mask, but it is like so refreshing. And I'm just hoping that it makes me feel less dry because I've been feeling super, super dry over over the last week or so so I'm hoping that that helps so I'm sure I'll eat a snack in a little bit I bought these like new popsicles so I'm sure I'll eat them in a bit I'll share them with you guys not new popsicles I've had them 
so many different times and I've showed you guys so many times but I got peach and I'm very excited about it so I'm sure I'll eat that and I'll show you guys in a bit but yeah it's kind of where we're at right now a little check-in but yeah today's literally been filled with things that I just dislike doing I dislike I dislike food shopping more than anything else in the world if I could skip it or if somebody else do it I know we could do like a giant direct order where you order it online and then just pick it up but I kind of enjoy like, I, like, like being able to pick out my own stuff, you know what I mean? And, like, pick out my own fruit and, like, my own meats and stuff like that. Like, it's a personal thing. So, even though I don't like going, I don't really want anybody else to do it for me. Hashtag control freak problems. But I don't really enjoy doing that. I don't enjoy gift wrapping. I love giving gifts. And when the process is over, like, I love how beautiful our tree is now that everything is wrapped. And I very much despise doing laundry. But it's just something that has to get done. It's just my least favorite household chore. You know what I mean? All right, y'all, face mask is off. I have this Outshine Peach Popsicle, like I said I was going to. Normally, I get like the little skinny, tinier ones like that are like half of this size, but they didn't have any in our grocery store for some reason. Get the hair out of my face. And so I decided to go with this bigger one and just get them all in the peach flavor. Peach flavored things are literally my favorite things of all time. And so it is fitting and I'm going to be obsessed with it anyway. I think I've had these before. Have we had the peach before? I feel like we've had these before and I feel like I really like them. I don't really remember, but I think it was over the summer, but I always enjoy peach flavored things. So I know I will like them, but I am going to wrap up the video here. I hope you guys like this video. If you did, please make sure you go ahead and give it a, I have no thumbs. Please make sure you go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. You already know it supports my channel. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe, hit that bell notification so you never miss another video that I post. If you haven't already, make sure you follow me on my Instagram so you can see the fitness, health, and lifestyle content that I post on there. And I will catch you guys here next time.